National Weather Association. Weather from where you live. Well, there's our nice steady rain overspreading the area during this late afternoon and evening. And pretty much everyone's getting at least some nice rain. The back edge of it, though, is right along I-57 out here in eastern Illinois. So we're going to go from this steady rain this evening to more of a showery regime. As some of these scattered showers off to our northwest kind of pivot in. You know, some of these speckled little showers here in Iowa, those will move in as we get into the night. So even though the solid steady rain may tend to pull away, we're still going to get at least a little off and on rain action overnight and into early Friday morning, but it's cool. It's going to be a cool evening after a high today of 68 here at the TV station. We're right now in the 50s. We're going to stay in the 50s all evening long. Rain coverage coming down somewhat. Winds out of the northeast, roughly about 10 to 20 miles an hour. Now, 4,500 to three quarters of an inch of total rainfall expected area wide, even though, you know, we really need three to nine inches to pull us out of this long term deficit we've got, but we'll take what we can get. You know, there could be a couple isolated storms Saturday as well as Monday, but overall the pattern will start to turn drier again and also hotter. Now, after 50 to 55 tonight, we'll be in the 60s tomorrow, pushing 70 pence. Perryville and Petersburg all at 69, but 68 at West Point, 67 Lafayette, 66 Chalmers, and about 63 kind of cool at Denver. And then Saturday it warms up 74 Rochester, 75 Monticello and 77 is the Attica, Crawfordsville and Pence and 76 at Fallon. So there are your steady rains pulling away with time, kind of showery for the night early tomorrow morning and then a mix of clouds and some sun tomorrow with those highs in the 60s and a pretty stiff wind tomorrow. We're going to have winds out of the north gusting as high as 30 miles an hour, even 35 miles an hour at times. Total rainfall, heaviest amounts still look to be in our northern counties. We're up to three quarters of an inch may fall towards Logansport, Winnemac, and Rochester. Around a half inch Lafayette, Fowler, roughly about the same at Frankfort, and pretty close to a half inch expected at Williamsport, perhaps two thirds of an inch. Monticello up towards Headley and Burnettsville. So rain getting out of here tomorrow morning, a windy Friday, what windy a breezy to windy on Saturday, 76. There could be a couple little isolated storms right through here. Mostly sunny, 83 Sunday. A couple isolated storms right through here on Monday, but then it gradually starts to warm up. I've kind of pushed back the 90s a little bit. We'll stay in the 80s for a little bit longer, but eventually the heat will get in here. It's still going to be warm though, 85 Monday and Tuesday before back in the 90s to end next week and go into next weekend. You know, the good thing about this, no severe weather. It's just a good old fashioned steady rainfall. So kind of a nice evening to kind of kick back and yeah. listen to the pitter patter of the rain. That sounds like a great idea. Yeah. All right, Chad, okay. thank you so much. Well, Mike, an exciting time. for.